Hi. In the next few minutes we spend together, I'd like to impress upon you the importance of plain old, simple, everyday awareness. Take your finger and place it right squarely in the middle of your forehead. That's right, right in the middle of the forehead. Now, pay attention to what you feel there. Do you feel the pressure of your finger on your forehead? How much pressure is that? How about the warmth? Is your forehead warmer than your finger? Or is your finger warmer? Is there a pulse in your finger? Is your skin dry or warm? Take a second or two and pay attention to everything you can feel where your fingertip meets your forehead. Now, let your forehead and finger separate. Let your finger drop. Good. Now, what did we learn by this? Well, let me ask you first. Are you noticing that your body is a little bit more relaxed now after you did this? And your mind a little bit more centered? Well, why is that? And did you notice that during that period of time, you weren't thinking about superfluous things like getting your laundry done or paying the bills? All you did was become aware of a single point, that is where the finger met the forehead, and the body became more relaxed, the mind more orderly and peaceful, and things changed generally in a better direction. Now let me ask you this question. What in your life is more important than anything else? Think about this for a second. What is most important to you in your life? That's it. What did you come up with? Did you come up with family, health, love, job, money, ice cream? That's one of my favorites. Okay, for me, the most important thing in life, in my life, is awareness. I mean, think about it. If you don't have awareness, what do you have? You can't enjoy love. You can't enjoy good health. You can't enjoy anything. Awareness is necessary for anything to be realized. And so, just having awareness brings life to life. It opens up our lives. The problem is, we normally have a common awareness or an everyday awareness, and it goes something like this. We have a thought, then we have another thought, then we have another thought. And they may be related for a while, and then they jump track. For instance, you might think about getting your laundry done. Then you might think about, oh, you have to drive across town to get something done. Then you might think about Aunt Tilly in the hospital, okay? And this seems how the day goes. In fact, that's how day after day after day goes. Thought after thought after thought all through our life. And then we get to the end of life, and it just seems to be a collection of thoughts with experiences tagged onto it. That's thinking without awareness. What we learned here was just simply by becoming aware of the present moment right here, right now, by putting the finger on the forehead, that we got more relaxed and we seemed uh, more peaceful. So what do we find here is that simple awareness, and this is just a very simple uh, experience of it, simple awareness can have an effect on our lives. The quantum entrainment process is much more than simple awareness. It's a very, very profound awareness that has an immediate effect, a very deep rest, healing rest, on our bodies and our minds. And that's why it's so effective. That's why healing takes place in seconds instead of days or months.